Ethical leadership is defined as the process of influencing people with respect to ethical beliefs and values while maintaining the dignity and rights of others. Simply stated, always trying to make the proper decision no matter the circumstance or the people involved. Ethical leadership isn't always easy, but when we focus on doing the right thing in all situations, others we interact with on a daily basis will know where we stand. By modeling desired behaviors, we earn the respect and build trust with others. Ethical leadership is at the heart of all leadership decisions. We must consider laws and procedures, conflicts of interest, as well as the culture and values of our organization. Making ethical decisions takes the pressure off of the leader because the focus is on doing the right thing, not necessarily the easy thing. When we make ethical decisions, others we are in contact with on a daily basis will be influenced by those decisions. In the book, Seeds of Greatness by Dennis Waitley, he introduces the integrity triangle. He says when making decisions, ask yourself three questions. Is the information true? Is this what I believe I should do? Is what I say consistent with what I do? These questions are helpful in creating rationale to support a decision. Modeling ethical leadership can be done in several ways. We must be a great example by our words and actions. This has to be done on a daily basis. Also being consistent in our decisions, providing truth and grace, treating people with respect, holding others accountable, demonstrating appropriate discretion, and owning our mistakes are all ways we can exhibit ethical leadership. The attribute of ethical leadership is very important to students. Students have more outside influences than ever before and having a grounded ethical foundation of thinking can help them when faced with difficult decisions. Fortunately, I had great ethical influences growing up. My parents, grandparents, teachers, and coaches all played important roles in my life. As a teacher and coach, I aspire to be that for my students and players as well. Thank you.